Hi, I'm Mariam Bepis and I'm here with Irfanu from Irfanistan and he's got some questions that he wanted to ask a lot of time so I will just dig right into them. How did your journey into the entertainment industry begin? What inspired you to pursue acting? Well, it began with the Aradil and Munkir at the same time and nothing really truly inspired me. I just have this thing in me that I want to try different things so I was just like okay let's give it a try why not. Uh, yeah, I've tried to play different characters but uh, the favorite one would be Zermine from Deare Dil because you know that first project is your first project is very close to you so I think because of that also. Otherwise I feel like all characters just somewhat stay with you. What challenges have faced you? I think the biggest challenge is the fact that we have to shoot for 12 hours. Our family is neglected, our, our social life, our friends. Um, so yeah, making time for them in between and that's why I decided that yeah, ye itna lengthy kaam mein har bak nahi kar sakti. I'm just gonna do one project a year and the remaining year I'll just be doing other things. So see, as I told you, it's very difficult managing um, personal life and professional life because we're working 12 hours a day. But uh, how I overcome is by working less <laughs> and uh, spending time with my husband and spending my uh, spending home, uh, off days at home in Islamabad. So yeah, I feel like uh, working less is kind of work. Well, I currently there. Uh, currently, there are such nice, exciting dramas on air, and I feel like television industry is something that is really well watched and widespread. Uh, Alhamdulillah and Mashallah. So I feel like, Inshallah, we'll keep on doing great things. Uh, how do I prepare for my role? I don't have a specific um, routine that I follow. But I definitely uh, read the script. I definitely do my own characterization. And I think it's good to get into the idea of what my character will wear, what she will wear, what she will wear, what she will wear, and you know, her accessories and everything. So yeah, I, I, I like the idea of creating that character. I would love to do something comedic, some satire, and I feel like a role that I would love to play. There are two, there are two roles that I would really want to do is a specially, a specially abled person, um, maybe somebody who can't see or can't talk or I don't know, but somebody who can't, a girl who can't see, I would really like to try and uh, um, oh yeah and I definitely want to um, play a character of a prostitute and the reason behind playing a prostitute is because I've done uh, a documentary with them and I think I've seen them and I've heard their stories so closely that I would love to you know bring it to life on, uh, in one of my plays. Yes, I love reading, I love traveling, uh, especially after Shadi because my husband is crazy about traveling so he takes me to all these exotic places and I mean my god, our planet is gorgeous, this world is beautiful so yeah, I definitely like exploring and doing different things. How do you spend your free time when you're not working? So, per se, I don't have, I don't get to have free time because uh, if I'm not acting, I'm producing or simultaneously it's going on. Otherwise, I'm doing my philanthropic work. So, I would say my off days are at home with my family in Islamabad and just like in my jammies with my doggos. That's a perfect day. <laughs> Yes, um, I'm very, I'm very passionate about uh, women's rights. Uh, right now, as of right now, I'm very passionate about animal rights because, uh, I mean, उनके साथ बहुत जाती हो रही है और वो भी जवान हैं, so we really gotta talk about them and spread awareness about them. And I feel like, yeah, and, and other than that, women's rights, uh, that's something very close to me. Domestic abuse, uh, fight against cancer, and all these things are something that I personally really 
they're close to my heart. If I wasn't an actress, I would have been probably been a full-time philanthropist and a producer. That I really like. And uh, I feel like there's a message for all the girls and women out there that please, apna tibbi moina. Uh, breast cancer se related zarur kare. Uh, I know people who found me who recently did their own uh, checkup and uh, their um, and, and they found that they had a lump. So please apna check up regularly kare. And koi ghabrani ki baat nahi hai. If we catch it early, uh, it's very well treated. So please take care of yourself. Thank you for all the love and all the support. Uh, I truly cherish it and uh, thank you.